There are too many people who, who have gotten tired of even identifying. If you go to America, it is a pride to carry the American flag, to wave it, and to be publicly identified as an American, a Briton. There are places where you identify yourself as a Nigerian to your detriment. Because you are considered a criminal until proven otherwise. Or considered something else. And it is such a terrible situation for a person to be ashamed of his nation. Waiting do us. I don't need anybody to prophesy to me to know that one of the most blessed nation on the earth, one of the most blessed Somebody may say it is arrogant to say the most blessed. But let's say one of the most blessed. There is no field of endeavor where a Nigerian cannot compete with another person from any part of the world on any subject. Whether it's in sciences or invention, in technology, in IT, in medicine, in arts, in sports, a Nigerian boy, a member of this church, went to the UK to do postgraduate training in neurosurgery, brain surgery. A course of five years, he did it in two years. The professor, white man professor, who was interviewing him in his final exam, by the time he finished, he told the boy, you know what? You know this thing more than me. Welcome to the moment of truth. Thank you, my people. It's uh, Thursday today, 17th of October, 2024. You heard NHL lamenting. He lied there. You know why I said he lied? The boy that is doing well in UK, he said the boy was from his church. Now lie! That's how they attributed all of Nigerians that is making it doing exploits in USA, in UK, to themselves. Once you visit their church once or any of your family goes to their church or anything, they will claim you. They will say they are the one made you. Now lie you. They never made anybody you. They are the one that destroyed Nigeria. Oh. Now they are pointing, pointing fingers at the politicians. Life. You know this thing more than me. Brain surgery. Member of this church. The boy is a member of this church. His mother is in the uh, hospitality here. Went to University of Joss. Started from second year on scholarship. Failed nothing. Do you understand? What, what field? Yesterday we read on commanding the day night prayer. The young man in, 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 in China. Olalekon is his name, right? The only person of black descent of African race that was included in a, 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 a scientific grouping of people who are inventors and other such realms. I think there have been only 30 so far. He's the only one that is of African descent and is from Nigeria. He won it this year, this, this, this few weeks. Anything you talk about, we have one of the largest gas deposits in the world. Maybe after Russia and one other country. Largest. But we are burning it away forever. Since the 60s. Gas flaring. We don't have any business with NEPA, with electricity. If the resources of the nation are harnessed. Everything is here. Gold is here. Everything is here. Why are we here? Nobody in this nation is meant to be begging. That's uh, Oluleke Babayomi. His project was distributed predictive cooperative control of smart power converters in microgrids. He has patented a lot of inventions. He went to PhD in China and then Japan. Shows Power Electronic Society, IEE Power Electronic Society. That's the, those are the people that, are on, that had won this year. Start from the, you can see all of them. Start from the beginning. All the people that won this year, 
two, three. That's him there. Do you understand what I'm talking about? Here is he there. Why are we here? Is it uh, on the spiritual level? Daddy Gio, Papo Yedepo. You're sincerely here and others around the country. We so, he went into spirituality. Are they, are they functioning spiritually? No, they are powerless. They are powerless. They are the ones that ruin Nigeria. If they are power, if they are power spiritually, they can bring Nigerian government to its knees. Prophet uh, Adebayo said it the other day. If they have power, all of them put together, they can deliver Nigeria from the hands of the politicians. But they, because they don't have power, they team up with the politicians to destroy Nigeria. And he's mentioning his thieves. He's mentioning Oedepo. Oedepo is banned in the UK. Oedepo is banned. Many Nigerian big pastors are banned in the UK. They are banned in the USA. But they will not tell you all this. It's mentioning Adeboye. Is Adeboye celebrated? Go online and see how they are dragging. Like I passed my neighbor generator. They have no good news. Even to deliver election to Peter B, they failed. Of Mantu, I stepped into a man's church in Pennsylvania and everything changed under one year. Got a gift of a private jet by an individual. Can you imagine the lies? He himself has no private jet, so, so he carry anointing to step into someone's church and the person, the church grow and the person got a gift, a, a, pass, a, private, a private jet as a gift by needy reader. It's a promo. Property of $15 million on this. Which kind of devil is on this ground? He must hear. You see the lies I'm talking about? Because he went to that man's church. Because he stepped in there. The church grow. They got property of one million dollars. And he's got, that's the church. And he's got a gift of a private jet from an individual. Now, like, yo, my people, don't believe all this lies. So this is not gospel, oh. We went to Singapore many years ago. They showed us condominiums, high-rise building, tall. You are like you are driving from the airport road, maybe all the way to like Maraba or something. The the tall rises. What are these buildings? He said they are buildings for the citizens, including those who are not yet born. House available. That was Malaysia. Yeah. But they came here also to, to get some things, both them and, and Dubai. Do you understand what I'm talking about? Also, these are people, what God put in their land, they are enjoying it. Denmark, they are enjoying it. Switzerland, they are enjoying what is in their land. Even Americans. Why won't the people of this land enjoy the goodness? And everybody can do well, and there will still be rich people. Sometimes when their head is home, they use their own mouth to expose themselves. And is practicing what is blaming the politicians for now. He's telling lies. He said they, they, someone gave a, a pastor a private jet gift. He's just promoting it. Too. That's what he wanted for himself. Too. He's putting an idea in the mind of some people. That has some some that has money or has uh, influence or something like that. That's the way they make Nigeria dry. All the pastors in Nigeria, if they have power, they are not supposed to be running up and down with the politicians. They're supposed to call them to order. They're supposed to call them to order, and that's what is happening in other countries that I mentioned. They use their resources to help their citizens. 
to build their own country. But this one, they are collecting. They are collecting here and there. Dolly Jonathan, allegedly, oh, they said they gave him contract. He didn't do it. Jonathan contributed a lot of money to the building of his dome. We saw that in uh, Adeboye's son now. We saw that. All of them are like that. They go to all these politicians for something. Not because of nation building. My people, no God for yourself. All the Nigerians that are making it abroad, they are not religious, so they are not religious. They know God and they know what they want from the Almighty God to make them great. Now, they are focusing on Nigeria abroad, though. That's why I'm saying they are target, oh. They are making us. The same person that is talking, he went to America, he was raising money. People should come out with £6,000, uh, $6,000, $5,000. The nonsense they are doing in Nigeria, they carry it there to America. You all saw the video. The same person that is talking called police for people that went to his church that, that was where Buhari must go. Don't worry, Buhari. He called police for them. Oh. They locked them up, including a blind man. See who is talking. When they have no message, they will be jumping up and down. And at the end of the day, they will take glory of everything. See how he lied there. That that boy, the neurosurgeon in the UK, his mother, maybe his mother goes there. But the boy, no. No. Just the way I did like I said, uh, he made me. I have to come out. This is Pastor Sunday from Kiev, Ukraine. Okay. Anybody there today? Uh, we're going to have a great meeting today, like we had in the morning. Many people believe that we had a great show this morning and that the world was uh, life-changing. And I got a lot of reviews and a lot of people actually said that was a trans transforming, life-transforming message. So I would like to welcome everyone that is there today. We'd like to welcome you back. Please let us know who you are. Uh, write something about where you are watching us from and uh, maybe what time it is in your place. Uh, just write us something so that I could welcome you. I want to welcome... That's, it. That's them for you. That's how they behave. Once you join them online, wherever, and they know you are a big person, they collect your information and everything. They will say they made, they start using you to proud everywhere. They start telling people they know you, they, they made you. People were wondering, what's Miss Tony doing there? How did you get this woman? Say, ah, I made her. I have to come out. When I heard it, I have to come out and say, I don't know him, oh. I only met him in 2018, oh. I was, God already made me. My people, I hope you learned something today. Don't ever believe any of these liars. Don't go there, oh. He's doing advertisement for his church, oh. NHL is doing advertisement, so oh. See the way he's, 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 he's promoting himself there when he stepped into a uh, Peninsula church. It's a lie. Don't ever believe anything that, com that comes out of their mouth, oh, in a lie, yo. No God for yourself. No God for yourself. If you are a billionaire, you go there, they bring you down. You see the life of uh, uh, Wigwe. You see the life of uh, Mr. King Bala. They brought them down. They destroyed many millionaires. Billionaires. They don't add value to anybody. They demote people. My people, know God for yourself. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye for now.